Biden has been in office as President of the United States for nearly eight months. The turnaround in Sino-U.S. relations that many people expected did not come as expected. According to Financial Times report, the U.S. government is considering a request made by the DDP authorities. Taipei Economic and Cultural Representative Office in Taipei changed its name to Taiwan Representative Office. This will mean that the U.S. government abandons the One China policy, send a serious wrong signal to the Taiwan Independence Forces on the island, add fuel to the already tense relations across the Taiwan Strait, crazy testing of China's bottom line. Why is the United States so entangled in the sensitive Taiwan issue? Its intention is to use it as a means of anti-China suppression, contain China's race, divide it, and disintegrate the country. Finally, obliterate the socialist system. But China's sovereignty, security, and territorial integrity, no one has the right to interfere. The U.S. has stated truthfully, as long as to achieve one's imperial purpose, the unscrupulous nature of the U.S. empire. China is currently taking tough measures, resolutely respond to the conspiracy of the United States to split the country. The Chinese party and government condemn the United States. This move is a response to the One China Principle and the blatant challenge of the Straits Sino-U.S. joint communicates outrageous and unreasonable behavior that violates China's core interests and seriously clarified conspiracy to smash the anti-unification forces inside and outside. Solve the Taiwan issue a third will to achieve national reunification. The United States considers agreeing to change the name of Taipei Economic and Cultural Representative Office is to use Taiwan as a tour man, not taking Taiwan as true love. The U.S. talks about Taiwan and cross the democratic alliance, the value of freedom. These are all practices. If there's no China factor, America doesn't care about Taiwan. The DDP authorities are based on the nature of the Taiwan independence. Disregard the fundamental interests of the Chinese nation and the well-being of the Taiwanese people. Being willing to be the board of external forces, constantly playing tricks internationally for independence to provoke troubles. This will only seriously damage the peace and stability of the Taiwan Strait, push the people of Taiwan into disaster. No matter how you interact with external forces, Taiwan independence cannot change Taiwan being a part of China, cannot stop the historical process of inevitable reunification of the motherland. Taiwan independence is a historical countercurrent and a dead end. No one should underestimate the Chinese people's defense of national sovereignty, determination, and territorial integrity.